Good, great. What's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. Um, we're gonna do some crazy shit today. Yeah, well, gonna, you are. Yeah, I don't know how to skate. <laughs> but Nate is about to skate the world's most expensive skateboard. So if you want to see the unboxing and him skating it, you keep on watching. Keep on fucking watching. <laughs> All right, you guys, so before Nathan unboxes everything for you, I want to give you a quick backstory that this collection was so hard to get a hold of, but just from being such a loyal Louis Vuitton client, they offered um, this crazy trunk for me. So there is literally like 10 made in the entire world. Um, you know me, I'm fucking over the top as always. So when it comes to Nathan's birthday, I'm like, bitch, we're, we are going to take it there and make his jaw drop. So, um, yes, this is uh, a crazy ass fucking price tag. The grand total with tax is $59,268 with 76 cents. You can't forget that, baby. <laughs> is it over the top? Yes, so is my whole entire life. Um, these things are so cool because they are collector's pieces and even in one to five years, this will probably be tripled in value because it is so rare. So. Um, I'm gonna let you uh, guys go on a little journey with Nate as he um, unboxes everything for you. Then, of course, you saw us at the skate park. We're gonna see if this motherfucking board works. All right, so we're about to open up this trunk and see what we got going on in here. Oh, shit. Okay, they got a nice strap. Looks like you can strap this right on here and lug it over the shoulder if you need to. Might need to use this. Oh, wow. They actually even looks like they even ha have nice trucks on here. Yeah, they're independents. Probably one of the most biggest well-known trucks, like truck brand ever made. So that's that's really nice to see, and the fact that they just put the little Supreme logo on that is so sick. They even got the Louis Vuitton strap on here. This is like a ratchet almost. It's pretty tight. Bone Swiss bearings. Okay, coming in with that good shit. That's what's up. We got some secret compartments down here. All right, let's check out what we got in here. Okay, it's pretty much just like some storage areas. Probably, you know, put some trucks in here. Oh no, that is actually for trucks. Yeah, these little things, the little bolts, you can just sit your trucks right down in it. That's tight. Oh, we got some secret stuff in here. Got this little pouch or something in here. Let's check it out. Oh, got the nice basic tool. I mean, can't go wrong. Does everything you need on the skate park, so. I wonder what this is for. Oh, it's, not, oh, it's just like some stuffing in here. You could probably throw some bearings or maybe in some a little hardware or something. Well, since we're about to skate this for the one time only, I'm gonna put this back in here. Close this bad boy up. Lock her up. No, oh, what's this? Oh my God, Jeffrey did not. He got my initials put on the little tag. Oh, even on this one too, check that out. That is so sick. Oh hey. Looks like baby's nice and ready to go. I'm ready. Let's go. I put on some shoes to match your board. That's where I like to sit. <laughs> All right, you about to try it out? Yeah. How, how is it by the way, I'm like. I know nothing about skateboards, you guys, so... They did a really nice job. Really? Oh yeah, they did great. Hell it's yeah. Nice grip tape, too. Mm -hmm. Can't go wrong with it. I love this little detail right Yeah, here. I know. Cute. They went in on everything, really. Alright, well, let's go give this bitch a whirl and see what she's made of. I'm gonna go roll around the park and see how this bitch handles. All 
right, so Nate just skated it for one lap, and yeah. look at it. Yeah. I mean, look, just because yeah, it's, it's is, Louis Vuitton doesn't mean it ain't gonna scrape. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> this is this is normal stuff, yeah, but. Let's see, the, let's see the print, this is what I'm scared of. Oh, so what was this, a board slide? Yes, yeah, so I did a nollie board slide to regular, and then I tail slid on the spine over there. <laughs> okay, so let everyone know at home if they're really, like maybe people, some people have never even skateboarded before. I'm sure a lot of you at home have, mm. but how did it feel um, riding it for the first time? Was it shitty, was it great? Oh no, it's so smooth. The bearings that they have on here are probably one of the best bearings that you can have. Thank God. Okay, so, cool. All right, she's butter. All right, let's go let have Nate uh, have fun for a few minutes and uh, see what happens. Let's do it. Yeah, no, I'm good. I just hit a soft spot on my elbow. Uh, Can't like pick up my arm. Are you good though? I'm good. I don't know if the board is though. Okay, let's zoom in right here. Holy shit. What is that? Like a, a little crack, a break? Yeah, I mean, this would be a break. This would be KO. Damn, I mean, you hit that shit hard. I did, and I fuck, I was floating for a minute. Damn it. Let me see the back, is it broken? No, you can't tell down here. It's just on the top few plies. Is it okay to still ride, you think? I can still skate it, but I gotta be careful. Yeah. Yeah. If this shit breaks in half, Louie, you better send your girl a new one. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we are back home. It was really hot out there. It was so hot Nate's today. It's like dripping sweat. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so let's give your final first impressions on the board. Um, overall design compared to a normal good skateboard, how would it be? I would say it's pretty much the same as your average pro, you know, pro skateboarder, you know, okay. pro deck or pro anything really. Yeah. Um, um, okay, so so we'll zoom in on some of the, we got some scuffs, uh, some scrapes, obviously got a little crack here. Yes, it did get a little crack, which... My biggest fear, so I what, know, what, what trick mine. were you doing? I was doing just an air over the spine, mm -hmm. and I was doing an in indie grab as I was doing it. But I shot out too far, and my foot was too far up on the right. skateboard, so I put all my pressure on this, and it just... Your kids want it, baby. Yeah, but they do, <laughs> they want to see the skateboard trunk. So we do have a break in the board. Um, yeah, I obviously, mean, I wanted Nate to write it. Yeah, and I definitely wrote it. So I mean, and you can't blame it. It's not, it's not the the brand or Louis didn't make a shitty skateboard or anything. It was just it's more of a common occurrence. I mean, just because you know Louis made it don't mean that it's shitty and it broke. It right. actually is <laughs> a really nice skateboard, and I just landed on it wrong. Right. Days ago, I broke a skateboard in like three or four days. It just happens, you know, so. So, is the Louis Vuitton Supreme Collaboration skateboard legit? You happy? It's it's definitely fucking <laughs> legit. It's 
I mean, you couldn't ask for anything better, really. I mean, a lot of the stuff on here is top tier. Right. Well, maybe you'll put that one in a glass case. Yes, we will. And then um, I am going to put it out there that I am going to ask Louis Vuitton to order and buy a pristine board to put back in here. If mm. not, it doesn't matter. It's our collector's item. The trunk alone is unreal that they yeah. even offered it to us, which is so fucking cool. But oh, yeah. Um, yeah, so I'm really happy. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching another crazy video of ours. I hope you enjoyed it, and um, I might go shed a tear for that crack in the board. I know, I, I'm probably gonna go shed a couple. <laughs> All right, you guys, we love you, and we'll see you on the next one. Bye, guys. See ya. Mwah.